In this video, we will discuss the deferral and lockout procedure for the engine any ice valve. The engine anti ice valve is a normally open single element inline sleeve valve with a modulating shutoff piston. The valve can be opened manually through a manual override. The override device, which passes through the forward flange, must be turned 270 degrees. This will move the cam, which pushes the piston to the open position. A disagreement between an engine anti ice valve and a command will give you an engine 1 or 2 anti ice valve fail ICAST message. Here's an illustration of the engine anti-ice valve. Notice the manual override feature. This will be located on top of the valve when installed on the engine. Engine 1 or 2 anti-ice valve fail could be active on the ICAST display in the cockpit. Refer to the MEL for procedures to defer and deactivate the engine any ice valve. Gain access to the top of the engine cowling. Remove the engine anti-ice panel. It's the outermost panel. Loosen the two lock screws, then press and turn the manual override 270 degrees with a quarter inch wrench till it lines up with the lock indication. Tighten the lock screws and reinstall the panel. Ensure the push button switch is deactivated and install the orange DMI placard above the switch per the MEL.